Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brianna. If you're new here, I own an online store called Breleaf Boutique. In today's video, I'm going to be taking you guys along with me to get some inspiration for this wall. It has been so plain. I have my two shelves with all of my inventory on here. Um, it just doesn't have anything going on <laughs> and it's not inspiring me at all. So I've been wanting to get some things to go on this wall to make it look a little bit better and also some organization for the inventory on the shelf so I can probably fit a little bit more on them. I did order some shelves that stack on top of each other from Amazon so I can put all of my t-shirts in them instead of taking up a whole row for t-shirts. did order two of them to go ahead and test them out and see how they work. They'll be here tomorrow. Essentially, I do not want these t-shirts laying flat like this. I want a couple t-shirts on each shelf and that frees up more space for me. I'm also going to look and see if I can find any more organization stuff either at Target, TJ Maxx, Burlington. I know sometimes they have some good home decor finds. I'm going to take you guys along with me. I still need to go pick up my groceries from Walmart, bring them back home, and then we'll go shop. But let's go ahead and get into today's video. I did also want to mention that in my last video, if you watched that, I did say that I had a pop-up shop this Saturday. Because my week was just so long, my days were running together. I was working 8.30 to 5.30 and then 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. So for some reason, I thought that pop-up was this weekend. It is not. It's actually next Saturday. I don't know what was going on, but no pop-up this weekend. I'm sorry. Bye. I love you. I love you. I see you when I get home. I still do not have a tripod for my car. Not really safe to hold my camera and talk while I drive. I may not talk in the Jeep too much. I will see you guys whenever I get to Walmart. Y'all, I've been sitting at Walmart to pick up my groceries for like the past 10 minutes and just realized I never even checked in. <laughs> okay. Hey. Hi. <laughs> Well, probably we'll eventually see that my dog does wear a diaper. He actually has idiopathic epilepsy, so whenever he has seizures, he cannot control his bladder. So don't make fun of my baby. He's just a big baby. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. So it is not a shopping trip without some Dunkin', so that's where we're going to go next. Hey, can I have a medium vanilla iced latte with cold foam? And that'll be all. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. show you guys what I got at TJ Maxx Burlington and Michaels I think is the only places that I ended up purchasing some things from they had all of their Christmas stuff out so it's like all of the regular decor was just gone I didn't get as much as I wanted to but I found a couple cute pieces whenever I walked into TJ Maxx there were zero buggies available so that's when I knew no way I'm about to film in here. TJ Maxx had a lot of cute shelves, the collapsible shelves that you can use at a pop-up event. If you're looking for one, I definitely would go check out your local TJ Maxx and see if they have some because they were super cute and I'm sad I didn't take a video of them. I did take a video of one I found in Burlington. It was very pretty. I had gold details and the shelves were like a wooden uh, texture. I don't know if you're into that, but if you are, I thought it was super cute. It did collapse, so the shelves folded upwards and then the sides fold in. You could definitely use that if you were going to a market event. Let me show you guys what I got. From Michaels, I got three different sizes of these self-sealing clear bags that I use for packaging because I'm running low. So I got five by seven, four by six, three by 
fives. Got a paper hole punch. I actually got this from Target. Target pickup order yesterday. I thought it was gonna be pink and they gave me yellow. Nothing wrong with yellow, but I really like pink. In the picture, it did say pink and I went back and looked and it said the color varies. I guess they give you whichever one that they wanna give you. My husband requested these foam painting foam bracelet. He needs these for something for his car, so I got him those. On to Burlington, I got, this isn't really anything office related, I guess it kinda is, but it is pumpkin and cinnamon fragrance diffuser. It has the really pretty fall leaves on there, and I just thought it was really cute to add a touch of fall to my office and keep it smelling nice and seasonal in here. So I'll let you know how that smells. This was $5.99. Got some AA batteries because I have that pop-up shop next weekend, and that one is the night event, which is starting to get a little bit darker sooner now, so I definitely am going to need to rely on those lights. So I wanted to make sure that I had good batteries to put in those because I'm not sure how charged or how much life they have left in the ones that I used last time. So I'm just gonna have these as a backup. These were at Burlington for only $3.99. Batteries are usually pretty expensive, so I thought that was a pretty good deal. And the last thing I got from Burlington, I really wanted something to go on my wall back here above the shelves. Um, I've been considering moving my LED light sign right there to this wall because you can see it whenever I'm filming. I think that would be really nice to have right here, but my husband it up and I don't know how he's going to feel about me asking him to move it and I'm, I'm really not sure yet did find these and I wasn't finding anything so I was super excited that I actually found something that I liked. This is what it looks like. It came in a pack of two. I thought they were very neutral and style that I like. Um, I have a lot of pink going on in here so I thought the neutral would look really good and it has really pretty, I don't know if they're rainbows or just arches but they look like rainbows to me and I just thought they were very pretty and so I'm gonna ask my husband to put these up later. So thank you in advance to my husband for putting this up for me. Next, what I got from TJ Maxx. I across these clear um, drawer organizers. It comes in a pack of three, so it has the two um, squared ones and then it has the long rectangular one on the bottom. I like the clear organizers. I think they just look so pretty. They just go so well with everything. So I had to get these, they were only, they only $5.99. That's good. I didn't even check the price. <laughs> Got this really pretty vase with the pompous grass. I thought this would be really cute to put up on top of my shelves. I'm gonna get rid of all this stuff that's up here. Um, but I thought this would be really pretty and I think it goes really well with the wall decor that I got. And I can honestly use this whenever I'm in a market event too for decoration because it's not super big. I could set it on the table or my collapsible shelf. I just think it's so cute and again, super neutral, which is my style, what I like. You can never go to TJ Maxx and not buy your dog's dog toys. I have to get one every time I go. I ended up getting two balls that squeak for them. Even if I get them the same thing, which I always do because they fight over them, they're still gonna fight over one of them. So if it may be this one that they just decide to fight over and they don't want this one, it's ridiculous. I just can't come home empty handed for my dogs. Anyone else feel that way? I just feel so bad whenever I go out and shop and then I come home and I don't have them anything. I was not there looking for shoes, but I did end up getting these really cute booties, which I think they're gonna be so cute to take some photos of my new arrivals in. I really wanna wait for a really nice day to put on some clothes from a store and go out to like a really pretty field or downtown somewhere and take some photos. Look how pretty. They have like a gold plate on the back here. They're gorgeous and they were only $30. The last purchase from TJ Maxx was this bin. So I could either use this at the bottom of one of my shelves to put stuff in or I could even use it at a market event to put some like slippers in or t-shirts or even put it on the table like this and set some stuff down in here and on top. But this was $12.99. I really didn't intend on getting another basket, but I passed it and this was before I got the buggy. So I was like, oh, like I could carry my stuff in here while I walk around. And then I ended up going back and getting the buggy and putting it in my buggy and keeping it. So 
yeah, that's everything I got. Well, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Whenever my husband comes home, I'm going to ask him to put those things up. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul, and I'll see you guys in a minute. I want to get this off of the top of my shelf. I want to put these in like a bin or something on my shelf so they're not just laying up here. And then these cups that I have left, I want to maybe move to the bottom with a basket. I want to put all of these into individual wrapping and put them in those little bins that I showed you and get these off of this shelf so I can collapse this shelf and put it in the bin for my pop-up stuff and get this off of here. And then this is a squish. My husband got them for me. It looks like my dog Shadow, so I thought it was so cute and that's why I have him up here. <laughs> Um, and then that is just some extra decor out there that I need to get rid of. And then I can decorate these top shelves and put the two wall decor pieces up here. And then um, reorganize these shelves because it's just too messy for me right now and I need some organization in my life. So that's what we're going to go do. these off of the shelf and try to put them in one of these bins and see which one they fit best in and then we're gonna store this shelf away so I can use it for pop-ups only. this is what it turned out like so this is the new picture that I got from Burlington and then I got that from TJ Maxx and this from my house I just put it up here for the fall and then the other one goes over here and that's the oil diffuser I got from Burlington and then I just kind of rearranged my shelves a little bit until I get my new shelving units in and then I put some of my jewelry in these containers and the little cup bags back there. And I definitely need more of these because I gotta put the jewelry on that stand and some. But yeah, I think it looks really good. That is gonna be it for today's video. Thank you so much for coming along with me while I shop for my office. I'll be back for another video next Sunday and that will be all the pop-up stuff. Like I said in the last video, I'm so sorry that was not this weekend. If you guys enjoyed, and please remember to like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.